so this is my um, September favorites, and I'm sorry about the lighting and the background. But yeah, I'm filming at night, so thumbs up for bad lighting, you know? I'm sitting on the floor though, so I'm really scared. I'm gonna feel like something crawling up me, and I'm getting really scared right now, because I hate spiders so much. <laughs> I'm really, really scared, but I'm doing this for you. So yeah, people on Earth, this is my favorites video, so let's get started. So my first favorite is my Urban Decay Primer Potion. Oh my gosh. This primer potion is so amazing. Okay, so this is my Urban Decay Primer Potion. I love this so much. It makes my eyeshadow stay on, like, all day long. Like, it's amazing. My next favorite, it's my Urban Decay Naked Palette. I love this thing so much. It's absolutely amazing, and... I'm not really going to go into much detail because there are almost like a thousand billion people on YouTube who have made like tutorials with this and reviews and hauls. So I don't really want to go into much detail because if you want to know more about this, just search Naked One Palette Review. Trust me, you will find at least 30 billion reviews. Then you will, you will like at least one. But those are the colors. They're really, really natural and shimmery, and I love them. My next two favorites are lip glasses. So the first one I will show you is by MAC. Both of them are by MAC. But this one is the Viva Glam Nikki. So, I mean, I wish it came with more products. Like, look at how tiny this is. It's really, really tiny. So I wish it came with more products. But besides that, I mean, it's really amazing. And that is just the little focus of Viva Glam Nikki. I really, really love this lip gloss. It is so pretty and so bright and just really unique. And I have the lipstick in Viva Glam Nikki as well. I think I like the lip gloss better because it's not as bright because it's more glossy, obviously, because it's lip gloss. So it's not too bright. And so then my next lip gloss that I want to show you is this one in, it's MAC Pro Longwear Lip Gloss. And sorry, there's like a glare. Okay. But anyways, this one is in Forever Rose. This is like a Taylor Swift red color. It's really, really crazy, crazy, crazy red. And that's what I really, really like about it. My mom got this for me. She, she said it's so bold and so bright. So she got it for me. You guys can see. Yeah, it's like a more of a darker red. <laughs> yeah, there's a the swatch. But it almost looks like blood. <laughs> if it wasn't shimmery and glossy, it would be blood. <laughs> but it's a really pretty blood. Um... I really, really like it. Again, it's like a Taylor Swift red, so I think it's going to be really good for some upcoming tutorials because it's a good Taylor Swift tutorial. So then I have two favorite nail polishes, both by MAC again. The first one is such a pretty pink color. It's in St. Germain. You guys might have seen the lipstick or the lip gloss or something in this color as well, but they also have a nail polish, and it's a really, really pretty pink color. And I wish, again, they came with more lip I mean, nail polish because this is, like, really, really tiny. But I really, really love this color. Um, I have it as, like, polka dots on one of my nails. I don't really know if you guys can tell. But it is such a pretty color. Um, again, it's a really pretty, like, bright pink, which is why I'm obsessed with it. And then the next one that I'm obsessed with is this other one by MAC again. And this is more of, like, a dark blue color. It's coming out looking black. Okay, there we go. That's the color it is. It's, like, a navy blue, midnight blue. And this is in the color, ooh, this is very dark. This is going to be hard to read. This is in the color Spirit of Truth. I'm not even going to try and focusing it because it's really, really dark, so you can't really see it. I have my favorite hand sanitizer of, um, or like germ thingy of this September, and my favorite one is Vanilla Buttercream. This is a really, really pretty like cupcake ice cream type of um, smell. It's nice and light, not too strong. But it is literally like literally the best smelling thing ever. My next favorite is a MAC lipstick, and this one is an Angel. This is literally such a pretty lipstick. Like, I'm obsessed with it. And the swatch came off, but it's just this really pretty, like, light pink color. That's what it looks like. It is literally, like, the prettiest light pink ever, and I love it. <laughs> my next favorite thing is my MAC Zoom wait, what is this? Zoom Fast Black Lash. And this is just a sample, but... Oh my gosh, I've used it like only twice, but it deserves a spot in my favorites video, so that's why I decided to give it a spot in my, a spot in my favorites video. So, 
just a really, 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 really thin brush, which is really good because it won't clump. But it is so volumizing, and I'm not going to put it on for you because it's pretty late, so I don't really want to be putting on too much makeup. What I've been using for face cleanser is a sample. I have like a trillion billion of these samples for this face cleanser because the lady gave us a lot. <laughs> this is the MAC face cleanser. It's really, really, really cleansing, which is why I love it so much. And yeah... I'm starting to run out of battery, so I'm going to hurry this up a little bit. My next thing is my Believe Justin Bieber CD. This is for music. This is new. I already have some of the songs, so that's why it's not opened yet. But I really, really love this CD, and I love Justin Bieber, so yeah. My favorite scent of this season has to be my Justin Bieber Girlfriend perfume. Number one, the packaging is like all fun, and it's just really, really cute. So that's like the lid, and then that's the bottom, and it's like a little heart. And this is a heart shape, so like when you put it in, it like sticks. It's really, really cute. And it's in a purple bottle, and this smells like absolutely amazing. Oh my gosh, I love this smell so, so much. It reminds me a lot of the Taylor Swift perfume, to be honest, but it has like that sweet flair, which Justin Bieber's last perfume had, which makes it smell amazing. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye. Uh, yeah, okay, bye.